Hello everybody, so just take you on a quick lap around Aldo Scrabanti in Port Elizabeth. Uh, 2.48 kilometer circuit with no, uh, 8 corners. Uh, normally a very, very abrasive track. Um, you know, the, the tarmac surface is very, very hot on tyres, so you know, tyre wear is important, but thankfully in our Audi Sassel Racing is 4 we have the Quattro system, so we don't have to worry too much about that. Um, all the way a nice long front stretch here into Turn 1. Uh, normally leads for good passing opportunities uh, up the inside, so nice late on the brakes. Down to third gear, long sweeping right hander. Important to get a nice late apex here of the concrete just to be able to get on the gas as early as you can. Now into the complex, a right left. Key thing here is to stay right as much as you can to get a good line out on the left hander. Obviously, to get on the gas as early as you can. A nice long sweep left to hang a fast right hander over a crest here. Just, just, just ballsy. You've got to use a curb and get on the gas as soon as you can, nice and fast over a crest there. Now into a tight, tight right hand, right hand hairpin in second gear. We're going to get on the gas as soon as we can, use the run out, use a quattro power out of there. Now a long sweeping left hander here, that I need the second left hander in the track. Uh, it's important yet again to get on the gas as early as we can for the run into the last corner. The racing here is super tight at PE. The last corner, a double apex right hander. Some people don't do double apex, I chose to use it last year. Uh, the important thing here is to get on the gas as early as we can for a long stretch down the front straight. Uh, up the gears and uh, that's a lap of Aldous Ferranti. Like I said, very close racing. The fans normally pack out in Port Elizabeth. So, you know, it'll be good to see you guys out there and uh, hopefully come and support the boys. See you soon.